Okay. Now I'm just gonna open everything. There's nothing inside except an empty glass. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. There's yeah, nothing yeah. inside. There's nothing inside. Still There's nothing keep inside. Opening. There's nothing inside. Darn it. Can we pick up the cup? Okay, good. What's in here? Don trademark infringing poopsie. Batteries, cheese, lettuce, ketchup. You know what? I want all of it. I don't want to pick that up. I don't pick up the refrigerator. I don't feel like the taste for a non trained bark infringing poopsie now. Okay. Yeah, we're just picking it up. I don't want to pick that up. Yeah, I didn't want Carefully to. Carefully handling broken glass. If this were a Sierra online graphic adventure, I'd be dead now. But those Mucus Phlegm adventure games treat their players much better. No arbitrary das just to extend gameplay? Sure would like to work there. Yeah. Sure would. Okay, good. We got all that. There's nothing inside. There's nothing inside. Open cupboards. Okay. Let's go out right here. This is Uncle Chuck's Indextron 3000 library filing lookup system. It uses the spewy decimal system to catalog books. Yeah, I don't really want to go there. Let's open this door. Okay. That was weird. Wonder what's in there. Ouch! No pinching. Wait. Oh no. This is a maze, isn't it? Oh god, it's a puzzle. Okay, well, where does this one go? Okay, what's in here? Ugh. What's going here? Franklin, you idiot! I'm just trying to, you know, help. Is that yelling? Don't gag me. I hope my dad and Uncle Chuck aren't fighting again. And since most of the machinery at the pillow factory is lying fallow, I've come up with this, you know, great plan to repurpose them. We can use them to make, you know, plush toys. Franklin, you idiot! The company is Pillowtronics, not stupid plush toytronics. We make pillows! What do you think that would do to our credibility, our reputation? O okay, Chuck, you're right, but um, I was up all night working on the business plan. Maybe uh, you could just, you know, look at it? No, no, no! It's a pillow factory! Are you two fighting again? I'm getting so sick of this! Your brothers! Take a chill pill! You started the pillow factory together! Won't you ever stop fighting about it? Nothing you need to worry about, Dolores. Uh, right, Franklin, old brother? Ah, yes. You know, your uncle and I were just, uh, you know, talking business. I have some work to do. Dolores, can you get my 0.8 millimeter point tip soldering iron? You know, Uncle Chuck, you should use a 2 millimeter flat tip, and you never heat your solder hot enough. <laughs> That's my favorite niece. I can't wait for you to take over the pillow factory. I know you'll keep the Edmund pillow dream alive. Oh, 
No. Hello, my favorite niece. Let's tell him. Let's see. I just wanted this to say one. how much I love you, Uncle Chuck. I love you too, Dolores. I can't what? wait for you to take over the pillow factory and restore the family heritage. No. It's not what I Hello, said. Hello, my favorite niece. It's probably what she's thinking. I just wanted to say how much I love you, Uncle Chuck. Wow. I love you too, Dolores. She won't say I can't it. can't wait for you to take over the pillow factory and restore the family heritage. Okay, well, let's Hello, my favorite say niece. something else. Okay. Let's see. You should be nicer to my father. He just wants to help. Franklin is well meaning, I will give you that. But he just doesn't have the same passion and vision for pillows that you and I have. Hmm. I just yeah. wanted to say how much I love you, Uncle Chuck. Really? I, I can't. Yeah, we'll skip that. Hello. Let's see. Uncle Chuck, I have something for you. What is it, Dolores? A letter George the Postman just delivered. Oh, I've been expecting this. I'll deal with it later. Hello, I don't think there's anything else we can say. I just wanted to say... I love my kid. <laughs> yeah. Modem. Mail it in. And get the job, okay. Let's get out of here. Let's just go this way. Ignore the maze. We'll go the long way. No. Oh. Open door. Do I just walk to it? Uh, use computer. I'm dialing the mucus phlegm modem number. It's connecting. Really? You I call can't a number and it connects? connected to mucus phlegm. Welcome to the new online mucus phlegm job application program. Just fill out your personal information and answer a few simple mucus programming questions. Then print out the application and send it to Mucus Phlegm. We'll get back to you in exactly five days. What is your name? Um. I just realized something. How are we connected to the internet? When the internet didn't go public? Until the 90s. And this is sometime before 87. Yeah. No wonder why she acted all surprised. Yeah, we'll do this one. Thank you. What is your address? Oh, shit. Oh. Crap. Crap. This one. Noted. Next, what's your programming language of choice? The language you are most proficient in. Uh, it's Pascal, right? Interesting choice. Please answer the following questions about our proprietary mucus programming language. You must get all of the questions right to submit your application. First question. When a game ships, it is encrypted using... Uh, hold on. It'd be better to find some reference book on mucus before I answer these. I need to go find a book about mucus programming. Okay, we know where to go for that. To the library. This is the library, right? Yes. Alright, let's use you. Hmm. It says there's a book on mucus here. It's in section 3.1. Okay. Well, here's one. Let's 
2.1. Is it up here? 2.2. Aha. There's a sign there. Better read it first. Okay, let's look at it. It says out of order. There's stairs. <sighs> oh. Uncle Chuck never should have talked to you like that. That's right. My idea was worthless. I'm worthless. Dad, I don't like to see you like this. I liked your idea for the pillow factory. Chuck thought it was a bad idea. He's right. He's never even read it. Yeah. Really, Chuck? Him to have more confidence? Please yourself. You need more confidence. And stop letting Uncle Chuck push you around. Thanks, Dolores. You're a great daughter. But Chuck knows what is best for the factory. Bye, Dad. I love you. Goodbye, Dolores. Okay. Why not plush toys? Well... Okay. Where's the three? There is no three. And that's gonna go up these stairs. The sign says the sign says it's out of order. Okay. We have to go higher. Is there stairs over here? Wait. Yeah. I didn't check Sick that out. Pillows. Let's go this way. Or not. We'll start going automatically down. Here. Look at that again. This is Uncle Chuck's Indextron 3000 library filing lookup system. It uses the spewy decimal system to catalog books. That we hmm. looked at, we can use it. It says there's a book on mucus here. It's in section 3.1. Well, let's find something else. Maybe there's a way from here. Is there a way from here? What about these books? Not action figures. These are my Chronicle of Narnia and Hitchhiker's Trilogy. I love my books. These are my Anne of Green Gables books. Maybe someday they'll do a TV show. Okay, what about this? It's my handy ASCII chart. Never know when you'll need to decode binary messages, so I always practice every day. Really? Well, what do we do? Oh, maybe we talk to uh, this guy, and he might want food. Digging? Hi, Doug. What are you digging? All right, Dolores. I'm just digging stuff in the front. Mostly hole, but then I buries them again. Oh. Okay, Doug. Ta, Dolores. Well, crap. My personal information has been entered. Just have to answer the hard mucus questions. What? This clock looks vaguely familiar. Maybe more highly rendered and smoother pendulum action. Well, I don't know where to find the book at. Maybe we'll try doing it first. I 
I need some happens. help. Gotta find a book on mucus. If only there were a large library nearby. There is. I must be doing something really wrong here. Let's go back inside. Hmm. I'll try one more thing. Oops, clicked out of the game. <laughs> All right, let's go talk to him. Talk to their uncle. Open door. Let's talk to him. Hello, my favorite niece. Thanks for Nothing. chatting, Uncle. Ch Why don't you? All my trons rely on it. Okay, Uncle. Ch uh, let's see. What is there here? It's Uncle Chuck's custom-built multi-band oscilloscope with phase memory monitoring. Okay, what else is in here? Oh, Dolores, shells. Dolores, Dolores, how many times have I told you not to touch my things? But as soon as you've taken over the pillow factory, they're all yours to do with as you wish. It's a whip made out of network cables. The label says it's called Cat 509 Tales, produced by GetDigital.eu. I guess Uncle Chuck was an impatient system admin back in the day. It's a defunct robot prototype. Oh, Look Dolores, at these shells. Dolores, Dolores, how many times? But as soon as. It's a letter to my <laughs> Uncle Chuck. The stamps haven't been canceled. It's turned on. Oh, really? Dolores, you know I can't work. After you've taken over the pillow factory, you can turn off the lights all you like. Right. It's Uncle Chuck's check register. I guess that makes it a Chuck register. Oh, that's bad. Let's pick that up. I'd better not touch it. Uncle Chuck gets it. real angry if I'm too nosy about his business affairs. Okay, let's pick up the letter. It's you a letter to my that. Uncle Chuck. As expected, the amateurs. I'd better not open it. Uncle Chuck would know if I read it if the envelope is ripped. Okay. Hello. So I picked it. Uncle I can Chuck, do it again. I have something for you. What is it, Dolores? It's that letter for you, Uncle Chuck. Didn't you already give that to me? I'll deal with it later. Uh, did you already give that to me? I don't know what you're talking about. That's hilarious. Okay, I must be doing something wrong. We'll see. Just gotta get back here. I'm determined to figure this out. The sign says the sign the sign the sign says it's out of order. Sorry, Dolores had to witness that. Bye, Dad. Darn it. I Goodbye, Dolores. Sorry, Dolores 2. had to witness 8. that. Two point eight. Yeah. Uh, what if I look at the two point eight? <sighs> see. Most books in the library are written by a backroom supporter. 
They assume all responsibility for their content. So I probably shouldn't read that. Uh, there might be copyright. Plush toys? So... Where am I going? I know I have a good idea. The sign says Is it's that? out of order. Uh Okay. Let's try to use that one more time. Hmm. It says there's a book on mucus here. It's in section three point one. I don't think they're good for anything, except growing mold. Wait a second. I thought of something. Yeah, we'll try this one idea real quick. See where it gets me. So what I'm gonna do is use I don't think they're good batteries. For anything. Except growing mold. Oh. Shoot. What if I, I don't use... feel like the taste for non trademark infringing poopsie now. Oh, you can eat that. That hit the spot. I think I'll just be careful with them. That's good and take that, Sierra Online. I don't have time to eat pie right now, even though it looks great. Ugh. I'm definitely not hungry for soggy lettuce. Okay. I can't use the bottle with that. I'm not going to drink from something without reading the label. I can't use, use the bottle with that. Flask wow. of Extreme Chili Sauce by Brian H.J. Comes with a warning. You might breathe fire. Maybe I should be careful with this. Now, let's use it. Holy shit, that's spicy. Wow. Well, I'm going to end this video. And I'm going to go look this up. Because I don't know what I'm doing. So... Thank you for watching, and I will see you later.